What's good to y'all? GP back. GP sneakers. Do me a favor, man. Like, comment, subscribe. I done got a good one this time. Got lucky. Got a slot time in Supreme this week. You know, they had the dunks come out. SB highs. They had them in this color. Blue and red. Green and yellow. I wanted to get all three, but they only let me get one. So I had to pick the color that I feel like is the most wearable. I already wore them. Because I don't care. Really love sneakers. I wasn't trying to resell them or nothing like that. But, um, yeah. Get right to it, man. My size. Size 10. I could wear a 10 and a half, but it's all right. A little bit of break in time. But, yo, these, these right here got the good leather. Nice thick cut leather. Came with the black laces, the little hang tag right here. We got quick 360. No love. By any means. And you got the New York with the embroidered check. But everything is embroidered. All the writing on this sneaker is embroidered. Supreme Team. Behind the tongue tab, it's like a white, I, I can't, I won't say silk, but it's a soft insole, like the, the liner, the sock liner is soft. Side look inside, see some cream across, and you're looking at it from the aerial view. These is fire, I'm not gonna hold you. This is it right here. Real good quality of leather. Nice thick cut. It's crazy how the dunks cost less than the Jordan ones, but the quality is usually better in my opinion. Supreme on the tongue tab. Yeah, I already got a couple miles on these things already. It's all good though. That's what sneakers is made for. They need to be worn. The black laces. They both got the say world famous on the on the tips of the laces. Nah, these are a good pickup, man. Taking a lot of L's this year so far, but this is a good one right here. I'm happy I was able to get these. Just wanna look at both the shoes, you know. Y'all can look at it and see if they made any mistakes. It's not impossible. So the, it's crazy, like both of the other colorways had a slimmer toe, back, toe box than this, but it doesn't matter. They made how they made, fresh out of the Supreme store, 100% official. Even though I'm not against all of the, I'm not against the, the bootleg sneakers at all, to be honest. But I feel like before I get into that type of talk, I gotta show y'all like why I would accept a, a a UA or a fake sneaker, whatever you wanna call it, because. They honestly all made damn near the same. And I could look right now and see, like, differences on this sneaker. It's not perfect. This toe box was a little... The, the right toe box, as you're looking, looks a little thinner than the left one. Nothing's perfect. It is what it is. But the quality of leather, though, these shits is it. Excuse my language. These is it right now. I'm hype. Happy with these, man. Might have to even get another color off of resale if I can't. If I could, probably use Afterpay or something. Because, man, these are definitely some kicks that you're not going to see. The last time they had Supreme Dunks come out, they came out in 2002, 20 years ago. 
pretty sure they'll have some other type of collaboration with Dunk Highs like this, and it's gonna be a while. But, you know, I like to keep it short, get straight to the point. GP Sneakers, see y'all soon with another video. Just like, comment, subscribe, share the video. It's a safe place for all people who love sneakers. Any conversations, any information I could give you, hit me in the comment section. I'll get back to you. Peace.